and step up to the left side of their broomstick. Come on now, hurry up. Stick your right hand over the broom and say, up. With feeling. Shut up, Harry. Now, once you've got hold of your broom, I want you to mount it. And grip it tight. You don't want to be sliding off the end. When I blow my whistle, I want each of you to kick off from the ground hard. Keep your broom steady. Hover for a moment. Then lean forward slightly and touch back down. On my whistle. Three, two... <whistles> Mr. Longbottom. on the ground while I take Mr. Longbottom to the hospital wing. Understand? If I see a single broom in the air, the one riding it will find themselves out of Hogwarts before they can say Quidditch. Did you see his face? Maybe if the fat lump had given this a squeeze, he'd remember to fall on his fat ass. <laughs> Give it here, Malfoy. No. I think I'll leave someone for Longbottom to find. How about the roof? What's the matter, Potter? A bit beyond your reach. Harry, no way. You heard of a man who said. Besides, you don't even know how to fly. What an idiot. Give it here, Malfoy, or I'll knock you off your broom. Is that so? Have it your way, then. 